Good morning, everyone. I am now launching the very first episode of Coffee with Karma. And today's mug, which will probably be every day's mug because it's my favorite mug, is this wonderful mug, Show Up, that I got from Molly Mahoney, who, by the way, has some really awesome content. You should check her out. And today, I'm going to launch everything talking about finding your author's voice. Now, before I started this episode, I went, because I could have sworn that I talked about this in my podcast, and I haven't. So I'll have to do that, because that way I can go into a deeper dive, because this Coffee Cup Karma is only a short shot. So what I want to do is leave you with one tip. One tip on how to find your author's voice. And that one tip is dig deep inside and understand who you are. Because your author voice bubbles forth from who you are. So just as an example, I'll take myself. I have really come to a maturity of my author's voice of being what I call professional and witty. (laughs) I'm never 100% serious. I always have just a little bit of humor in almost everything I do. And I say, whether other people think it's funny, I don't know, but I think it's funny. (laughs) I laugh easily, and that shows through in what I do. But I also like to maintain something of a professional tone. So I don't use too many colloquialisms. I don't use... Uh, salty language. Uh, Some people, that's part of their brand. That's part of their author voice. It is not part of mine. It is not part of mine. So who are you when you're with your best friend? What you want to do is take that and then polish it up so it's just a little bit more professional, maybe, or a, a little bit more refined. Because when you're out there in the world, you, you're walking this fine line between being 100% authentic and being relatable to your ideal target market. So what you want to do when you're being online, when you're being in your books, when you're being, be you, but be a dressed up for Sunday you. Be a cleaned up after a fresh shower you. Don't be the you with fuzzy slippers and crying your sorrows into a pint of Ben and Jerry's. Yeah, that's probably not a good idea. (laughs) I was just double checking. Mm, Maybe you could. I don't know. Um, That doesn't mean you have, you can't wear fuzzy slippers. I mean, right now I'm barefoot (laughs) because that's how I prefer to be when I'm at home. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that moment, that coffee with karma. Go out and find your voice and stay tuned because I think this is a really good topic. I will definitely be doing one on it for the Author Switch podcast, which you can check out at authorswitch.com forward slash podcast episodes. No, podcast page. (laughs) That's where you learn about the podcast. If you want to find just the episodes, you go to authorswitch.com forward slash episodes. And if you want to really help me out, follow me on Amazon. Just go to Amazon, search for Karma Spence, click on whatever link is my name, and then you'll see my little face and a little bio. And at the bottom, there's a little follow button. Click that. That's awesome. See you tomorrow for car for blah, for coffee with karma. Ciao for now.